Today we're going to look at how easy it is to set the exposure manually on a uh, Canon uh, digital SLR camera, in particular a Canon Digital Rebel. Uh, we're going to be using a Rebel T1i today, but the procedure is almost identical for every one of the uh, Canon Digital Rebel cameras. When you first look at a digital SLR, it can be really overwhelming how many different buttons and wheels and knobs there are in the camera, so you get intimidated by all that, but you really shouldn't be. To set the exposure manually, there's only three things that we have to work with. There's two wheels, the mode dial, the main wheel, and then one button on the back. So let's just go ahead and take a look at how easy it really is. So we'll turn on the camera, and then we'll go to our mode dial on the top of the camera, and we'll turn it to M for manual exposure, and we're going to leave it there. Now the next thing we want to look at is our aperture setting. So on the back we have our shutter speed and our aperture. And to change the aperture, we find the button on the back of the camera that says AB for aperture value. There's a little plus minus there. We hold down that button, and while we hold it down, we turn the main dial on the top of the camera. And as we turn that, we'll see the aperture number changes on the back. So for product photography, I like to shoot at a fairly high aperture, so I'm going to put it at f16. Release my thumb, and now our aperture is set. So now there's really only one thing left for us to adjust, and that is our shutter speed. The way we do that is we go back to our main dial on the top of the camera, and as we turn the main dial, we'll see the shutter speed changes, and we can go to a faster or a slower shutter speed. And that's really all there is to it. Now, one thing you might notice is there's this little scale here. Is what that scale is, is that's the camera telling us where it thinks that we should set the shutter speed for. So we see a little indicator flashing there, and we'll turn that until we get it under zero. That's where the camera thinks we should start out at. So we're not stuck there, but we can go ahead and take an image with it at zero. If it's too light, we can go to a faster shutter speed. If it's too dark, we'll go to a slower shutter speed. But that's really all there is to it, to manual exposure. So we set the mode dial to M, put it in manual exposure. We push down on the aperture value button and set our aperture to where we want it. Then we use the main dial to set our shutter speed. It's as simple as that.